Hi everyone, this is Sandy. Welcome to Easy Cooking. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make sticky buns. They are really easy to make, super delicious. The preparation time is going to be about 2 hours. And the cooking time is about 35 to 40 minutes. So I really hope you enjoy this recipe. Let's get started. Las cuatro de ingredients. We need three cups of all-purpose flour, one and a quarter cups of chopped pecans, two-thirds of a cup of maple syrup, a quarter of a cup of granulated sugar, half a cup of brown sugar, one package of quick rising active dry yeast, one teaspoon of salt, eight tablespoons of softened butter, one egg, two teaspoons of ground cinnamon, and one cup of warm water. Let's get started. We're going to start by greasing a 13 by 9 inch baking pan. I'm using 2 tablespoons of butter to grease it. Now spread the pecans and the maple syrup evenly over the pan and make sure the bottom of the pan is well covered with this mixture. And set it aside until you're ready to use it. Now in a large bowl, combine 2 cups of flour with the granulated sugar, a teaspoon of salt, and one package of quick rising active dry yeast. Mix until everything is well combined, then add in the water. Continue to mix, and also add in two tablespoons of softened butter. Mix once again, and add in one egg. And continue to mix until everything is well combined. You can continue to mix everything with a fork, but it's better to mix everything with your hands. So I'm going to put on some gloves, and I'll mix everything until I have a smooth and sticky dough. Once the dough is ready, stir in the remaining flour, and continue to work the dough with your hands until you have a soft and elastic dough. After you add the rest of the flour, the dough won't be sticky anymore. Once you have the right texture, which is soft and elastic, now cover the dough with a clean kitchen towel or a plastic bag and let it dry until it doubles in size for about 30 to 40 minutes. In the meantime, in a small bowl, combine the brown sugar with the ground cinnamon. Mix well and set it aside until you're ready to use it. Once the dough has doubled in size, on a flour surface roll out the dough to a 16 by 13 inch rectangle. Cover the surface of this rectangle with the remaining butter. We have about 4 tablespoons of butter left, so just spread it evenly over the rectangle. And then, sprinkle the brown sugar and cinnamon mixture over the surface of this buttery rectangle. Starting with the 16 inch side of the rectangle, roll it up tightly. Now cut the roll into 16 slices and place the slices in the prepared pan. Cover the pan with a clean kitchen towel and let the bones rise for another 30 to 40 minutes. Now preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Uncover the bones and bake them until golden brown and completely cooked for about 30 minutes. Let them cool for a minute, then transfer them to a serving plate. And that's about it. Enjoy! I really hope you like this video to print this and some other delicious recipes. Please don't forget to visit my blog. And don't forget to subscribe to be notified of future updates. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.